Greetings. You are watching the introduction to WAX, a unique music management system designed for music lovers. I am Jeff Barish, the creator of WAX. I created WAX because existing music management products did not meet my needs. I have a fairly large music collection, around 2,000 recordings, and many of my recordings are in the classical genre. Existing products force me to catalog recordings mainly by album title and artist. But if you have a recording of the Tchaikovsky Violin Concerto with Joshua Bell Violin, Michael Tilson Thomas Conductor, and the Berlin Philharmonic Orchestra accompanist, who is the artist? Wax does not impose this restriction. Also, I wanted to be able to catalog my collection by work, not by individual tracks. Whether the work is a Mozart symphony that came on a CD with two other symphonies, or an opera that came on a three CD set, I want my cataloging system to treat it as one unit so that it is easy to find and manipulate. I also want to be able to store more metadata, the cast of an opera, for example. If you are a music lover, you will find that these features of WAX and many others will enhance your enjoyment of your music collection, no matter the genres in your collection. WAX is a system comprising both hardware and software. This introduction will focus on the software, but for your interest, I'm starting with an image of the hardware. As you can see, the case is conveniently small and stylish so that it is easy to integrate in your audio video system. It is also silent as cooling is accomplished without fans. The box contains two hard disk drives with a capacity of one terabyte each. One disk is for the sound archive and the other is for backups. As you can see, there is also an optical disk drive for ripping CDs. You normally control the system using a tablet, but other configurations are possible as well. The system is turnkey, so aside from configuring your tablet, you don't have to worry about purchasing and configuring any other components or software to make the system work. The purpose of this introduction is to describe some of the unique characteristics of WAX and to demonstrate how easy and natural it is to operate the system. As you can see, the user interface is unintimidating and straightforward. There is no reason for music management software to look like a spreadsheet. Operation is natural because WAX imitates the way music lovers have always accessed their collections. In my CD collection, for example, I had a section for symphonic works alphabetized by composer, another for shows alphabetized by the name of the show, a third for pop alphabetized by the performer, and so on. In WAX, these sections of your collection are called genres. The first step in selecting a recording is to choose the genre. Once you select the desired genre, you will see a list of all the recordings in that genre. The list is based on a set of metadata tags unique to each genre. The symphonic genre lists recordings by composer, work, and conductor, whereas the show genre lists recordings by title, composer, lyricist, and date. This flexibility in the choice of metadata tags is one of the most important features of WAX. WAX permits you to define the set of genres and for each genre, you determine the number of metadata tags that you will use and their names. WAX makes it easy to locate a desired recording because recordings are listed using a consistent format and they are described using metadata fields sufficient to differentiate the recordings. Simply scroll through the list of recordings to find the one that you want to play and then select it. When you select a recording, another panel appears listing the tracks in the recording. By default, they are all selected because it is most likely that you want to listen to all of them. Did you notice that a play button appeared as soon as you selected a recording? Click on it to activate play. With WAX, you can be listening to the music of your choice in only three gestures. 
Select the genre, select the recording, click play. When you activate play, Wax automatically switches to play mode. In play mode, you can see all of the metadata associated with the recording, not just the metadata that you use to catalog the recording. Wax allows you to associate as much metadata as you want with every recording. You can also access Wikipedia to obtain more information related to the recording. The user interface for Wax has four modes which present related functions in a sensible way. You can select the mode using one of the buttons that are global to all modes. Let's use it now to return to select mode. Notice that the recording that is playing now appears in the panel on the right. This panel represents the play queue. To add recordings to the play queue, simply drag them to the right panel. Also notice that you can view and manipulate recordings by cover art rather than metadata. Edit mode performs several functions. You can change the metadata that you stored previously for a recording, import recordings that you purchased as downloads or ripped on some other platform, or rip a CD. To rip a CD, select the desired genre and then click Read CD. Wax goes to sources on the internet to obtain as much metadata as possible for the recording. I hope that this short introduction provided a sense of how much Wax will enhance your enjoyment of your music collection. The website has information about other features, and it also provides a way for you to contact me with any questions. Thanks for watching.